I felt like Hollywood is just spineless on math gang sign. Have you a, oh, like you don't know what it is clear shamelessness is not and will never be a superpower in the glitzy and glamorous world of Hollywood. There's always been a lot of buzz and chatter surrounding the not so glamorous side of the industry. There's always been a lot of buzz and chatter surrounding the not so glamorous side of the industry, whispers and rumors about the dark and scary secrets lurking behind the scenes have spread like wildfire. And one of the most contentious issues in recent times has been celebrities spilling the tea on what really goes on in Tinseltown. It's a topic that's captured people's attention and raised eyebrows all over. And if you ask me, those celebrities who dare to reveal the truth are often the ones who have been in the business for a long time, weathering its ups and downs, Jim Carrey's latest revelations have created quite a stir in Hollywood. It's as if a bombshell has been dropped, and everyone is buzzing with excitement and intrigue. Carey, Jim and his candid disclosures, a renowned actor known for his humor and charisma, has peeled back the glitzy veneer of the entertainment business to expose its inner workings, revealing the not-so-pretty realities that often lurk behind the scenes, but that's not all. Carey has also revealed the true reason for his extended hiatus from the sector that he previously dominated with his extraordinary talent. It's like drawing back the curtain on a mystery that has perplexed fans and industry insiders alike. The world of Hollywood is known for its allure and glamour, but Carey's revelations have shown that there's more to it than meets the eye. It's a place where fame and fortune come at a cost, and some may find themselves entangled in a web of complexities that can take a toll on their mental and emotional well-being as news of Carrie's revelation spread like wildfire. The sector is buzzing with arguments and conversations. Some consider him a hero for shedding light on the reality, while others ponder about the implications of daring to disrupt the existing quo. Don't go away because you'll know all the true answers by the conclusion of this film. You are aware I just want to warn people. Did I see that? Okay, in a second, I just want to inform people that if you go to a newsstand and read about me in these racks, 90% of what you're reading is sheer rubbish, total fiction. Many people believe that I am going through something, but it has been my entire life. And they say, well, it's a reaction to depression. He struggled with depression his entire life and there's no sign of it in me. Jim Carrey is without a doubt one of Hollywood's most successful actors, but it's no secret that his career has slowed in recent years. He got his big break in the 1994 comedy Ace Ventura Pet Detective, and soon after he became one of the highest paid stars, earning up to $20 million per film. He went on to star in several hit films, such as Bruce Almighty. Despite his flourishing career, he decided to take a break, and people were eager to know the reasons behind his hiatus. In 2018, Jim Carrey opened up about the real reasons for his break from the film industry he shared. I just didn't want to be in the business anymore, Carrey expressed his dissatisfaction with the influence of corporations. And how they were taking over despite his hiatus, Carrey eventually returned to the industry and took on a leading role in the acclaimed Showtime series. Kidding the role was specifically written with him in mind, allowing Carrie to showcase his comedic prowess once again. But this time he wasn't striving to be the familiar Jim Carrey that everyone had grown accustomed to seeing I'm not back in the same way he shared. I don't feel like the young Jim trying to hold on to my place in the spotlight anymore. Carrie's return to Hollywood as a more authentic version of himself allowed him to fully immerse himself in the character of Kidding, letting his comedic genius shine through effortlessly. As his career continued, Carey expressed his desire to break away from Hollywood's traditional leading man image and challenged the seriousness often associated with the industry. He sought to bring a refreshing change and touch of humor to the world of entertainment. While Carey experienced a slight resurgence in his career, with his involvement in the Sonic franchise, he made it clear that he was ready to embrace a quieter and more introspective life. 
In an interview, Carey shared his intentions to step back from acting, stating that he found fulfillment in his art's spiritual journey and peaceful existence. But it seems like he's come across something that changed his mind. Because recently, Jim has been exposing all shady dealings in the world of Tinseltown, one standout comment of his was regarding the ever-controversial issue of Will Smith Carey chimed in, telling CBS's Gail King that he did. Not approve of the Oscars crowd cheering Smith after his Best Actor winning speech, which came less than a half hour after Smith slapped Chris Rock. The standing ovation horrified me. Carey said, Hollywood is just spineless in mass, and it really felt like a clear indication that we aren't the cool club anymore. I was appalled by the standing ovation. I felt like Hollywood is just spineless en masse, and it just seemed like, yeah, this is a pretty strong indicator that we're not the cool kids anymore. Carey went on to argue that Smith should have been hauled out of the Dolby Theater, after hitting Rock for making an insulting remark about his wife, Jada Pinkett Smith, despite Rock's refusal to press charges. Carey stated that he would have taken a different approach, stating that he would have sued Smith for $200 million because the incident was captured on video and would have a long-term impact. Carey strongly disagreed with King's statement that tensions between Rock and Smith had escalated believing it was a spontaneous outburst caused by Smith's inner frustration. Carey, on the other hand, stated that he has no ill will against Will Smith and wishes him the best. He considered the event as a selfish moment that overshadowed everyone else's shining moment at the Academy Awards. Following the incident, the Academy took note and formally evaluated it, perhaps resulting in repercussions for Smith. In response, King Richard Starr offered an apology to Chris Rock. Smith agreed that violence in any form is detrimental and wrong, and that he overreacted emotionally to a joke about his wife Jada's medical condition, which was inappropriate. Smith expressed regret for his acts, adding that they do not reflect the person he strives to be, and he underscored that violence has no place in a world of love and peace. In a recent Access Hollywood interview, yes, you read it correctly, the beloved actor and comedian intimated that he could be saying goodbye to the big screen for good. Carrie, Jim the comic genius, is thinking about retiring. The shockwave began when Carrie was questioned about Dolly Parton's suggestion that he portray Porter Wagner in a biopic, which may have delighted fans. Carey stated openly that he is really considering retiring from acting. Could this be the end of an era for a man who previously demanded $20 million each film? The 61-year-old multi-talented artist, who has not only acted but also dabbled in painting and art, revealed that he is finding solace and fulfillment in his quieter pursuits, expressing his love for the serenity of a tranquil life, embracing his spiritual journey, and creating masterpieces on canvas. It appears that Carey has reached a point in his life where he feels satisfied with all he has achieved. A rare sentiment in the glitzy world of Hollywood Carey's admirers are left wondering whether they will ever see their beloved performer grace the silver screen again. Is this the end of the riotous laughter and unforgettable personalities that Carey created in the middle of this revelation? While appreciating the heartfelt event for his late friend Bob Saget, who passed away last year, Carey questioned the need for such gatherings to be turned into Netflix specials. It appears Carey isn't afraid to speak his mind and keep the industry on its toes. It appears that Hollywood has taken a toll on Jim Carey, and he has had enough. Will this truly be Jim's farewell? Only time will reveal the answer but one.